hello welcome back to the channel today we're gonna do a reading for taurus so let's hop into it we've got some archetypes some tarot and then some love messages from the person on your minds or your partner whichever resonates for you but of course i always say try not to make it fit with someone random <laughs> um so first we're gonna do an angel message just to kind of see the overall energy let's hop into it hard to shuffle these little guys all right there we go beautiful so message out from spirit today says better days are coming get ready your life is about to change for the better whether you realize it or not and recently felt lack divine is working on a special surprise for you interesting so that's got some beautiful energy to get you started let's hop into it see what archetypes come out Thank you, Spirit. Get one more. Perfect. Thank you so much. Okay. So let's see what we've got. We've got one under here. It's not even showing. Ooh. Could be a surprise of a new person coming in, or you could be just representing this energy currently. With the damsel card, though, it makes me feel like a relationship because it feels like someone feels like they have to come in and save you or like be there for you and support you um this may surprise you maybe it's someone you don't know or you're just getting to know with the networker card especially you could be someone Taurus. typically you're not afraid to be social right put yourself out there so you could definitely be someone who is like that um always networking making new connections with the damsel though it's like someone around you sees you as someone they want to protect and nurture and take care of the light attribute says understanding the nature of healthy romance inspires you to rely on yourself. So beautiful right now. It's showing almost two. You could be someone who is single, who's not pursuing relationships, who's more concerned on really just getting your priorities together and getting your life right before you focus on a relationship. I feel like for a lot of you, that's currently like where you're at. With the dilettante there, it says light attribute delights in the arts without having to be professional. Alerts you of the danger of becoming superficial in your pursuits. So it's just someone who is self-aware of the fact that you're just like working on stuff. Um, you could have a lot of creative projects. You could be someone who's a musician or a reader or you could be something else creative, right? There's so many different things you could do and you do it not for the sake of necessary any gain but just to like inspire yourself and those around you um so i feel like it's just saying not to get too caught up in that as well so let's hop into the tarot and see what we've got with the monk nun card out there last it's a light attribute says selfless devotion and single-minded dedication to spirit so you're someone who no matter what always remains um an empath or compassionate towards others and dedicated to divine and kind of trying to follow somewhat of a moral law or code with the cards out here so far it looks like you went through a major transformation ending in love now you're like going through new cycles you could feel kind of stuck with the six of cups here it's almost like you're worried you've got the six of cups in reverse and the ace of cups it's almost like you're worried that whatever you went through previously is just going to happen again. I feel like with this wand energy, it's like divine letting you know or your guides that no matter what you went through previously, like you've changed. So you're not going to go through those same cycles again. You could be worried about your stability or feeling stuck currently. Um, earth signs are all about the pentacles. Those represent earth signs. So it's really just saying you could feel a little bit imbalanced at the moment especially with the four coins maybe you are not working enough hours at a company or you're just getting by so you don't feel like you have full control of that aspect of your life right now maybe you feel like you're struggling to get caught up whichever it is just know that spirit is giving you the strength and the wisdom to overcome and figure out any solutions you need to currently um, i feel like for a lot of you 
you are someone who could tend to overwork as an earth sign i feel like taurus and capricorn are two of the hardest working signs in the tarot um but to each their own right to each person sign doesn't necessarily mean anything but it's definitely said that right so it's like you could be someone who is trying so hard for new beginnings you're just overworking you could even be turning down love offers at this moment in time and really just focused on gaining some sort of passion or new start spirit says you're like on a promising path for that wow so we've got the hermit card there so you could be in hermit mode currently trying to figure out where you're headed to next just know that you are being divinely guided down like an, a beautiful path and especially with the first message being better days are coming right it's just like letting you know that overall you can expect some good things to come in soon signs we have on the board that you could be dealing with um, so a lot of earth because we've got all the pentacles. So either Capricorn, another Taurus like yourself or Virgo. With the cup energy, you could be dealing with a water sign, Cancer, Scorpio or Pisces. And with the wands energy, we've got Aries, Leo or Sag. With the swords, we've got Gemini, Libra and Aquarius. So we've got all the signs. Let's go ahead and see some love messages or messages from the person currently on your mind. All right, let's jump into it. Yeah, overall, it's like you can expect some beautiful days, some big changes coming your way. And just for like a sudden change in luck or starting to feel like you can finally balance out where it is that you're going. So let's see what messages come out from the person currently on your mind or that you're dating or dealing with funny sometimes they come out and sometimes oh there we go okay so we got two so the first one says in case i haven't told you lately how important you are to me i just want to remind you you mean everything beautiful the first message so this could be for someone together or in separation says i live in constant regret forever thinking i could ever just replace what we had so that's the second message there we'll get one more message from the person on your mind today okay and then they all fell but this one specifically fell so we'll take this and trust this i trust you more than anyone i trust in the entire world sometimes more than i trust myself so that's a beautiful message from the person you're connecting with or currently caring about just letting you know that they really have an overwhelming amount of trust for you and it seems like maybe they don't always express it if they have a hard time trusting themselves in their own decisions but they just want you to be aware of that so that's really beautiful energy and yeah, I'm just going to leave it there. I really hope that resonated for you. Have an amazing day and take care.